guys, welcome back. This is me, Bruce, with another episode of High Voltage. And my voice is a bit scratchy today because I once again smoked too much, but I think it should be good. And um, I will do a task for operations attack just to mix it up. And before I do that, guys, quick announcement. Um, I posted a picture on Twitter um, of a Boom Beach t-shirt and yes, I will do a giveaway um, to thank you all for hitting 500 subscribers. Um, I haven't tipped the 500 yet, but I will do very soon. And um, thanks to Supercell for providing me awesome, super cool t-shirts. And I got two t-shirts, um, size M, no, size L for males and both in black color. And I will post a picture of the second t-shirt later on on Twitter and I will do a giveaway. And the way I plan to do the giveaway is um, it will be a time frame of about two and a half weeks um, starting from next Saturday or this Saturday, better say, until um, this uh, Sunday, the 13th of uh, September. And it will basically go like that. Um, you go ahead on my channel and share the video you like most and um, share it on Twitter and every time you share a video on Twitter I will get an email notification and, an, uh, and a notification on uh, Twitter itself. So I will know that you have shared the video and on the 13th of September, it's a Sunday, um, I will go ahead around um, uh, 7 p.m. Central European time. Uh, I will go ahead and see who, uh, see who actually uh, shared uh, one of my videos and I will uh, take all the names and I will put them into Excel and in Excel there's a function so that you can generate random values and I will basically assign a number to each name and then I will uh, generate a random value and so I will basically have a randomized draw of the winner and it will be two winners because I will give away two t-shirts and yeah um, they're limited edition so this is a pretty awesome limited edition t-shirts and um, you get them in a box, in a cool Boom Beach box. You see it on the picture and Twitter and um, it says uh, which which t-shirt it is and they are limited to 500 shirts per design and yeah, super awesome, straight out of Helsinki and yeah, in any way guys, thank you for supporting me and supporting the channel and for subscribing and commenting and liking and also disliking um also negative feedback is valuable feedback too and so yeah um stay tuned for the giveaway it will start this saturday i mean you can share my video sooner if you like i won't stop you from doing that but in any way it will start this saturday officially and go until the 13th of september and i hope that in the meantime i will actually hit the 500 subscribers and I hope that the two people who get the t-shirt will be very happy and will wear it with pride and show the world their love for Boom Beach. And I will also wear the t-shirt. I am planning to wear it at work um, on Fridays. I can come in a uh, casual look. So I'm planning to go to work uh, the next time I have work uh, because I have vacation at the moment. The next time on a Friday I will go to work with a Boom Beach t-shirt and I will probably take a selfie while I'm playing Boom Beach on the toilet. In any way, <laughs> yes, um, I will do the task force operations attack now. I will also post more details on Twitter um, so that the the, uh, the the requirements and the, um, the perimeters of the giveaway are clear to everyone. And yeah, I hope uh, you enjoyed that video and you hope uh, I hope you are um, sharing the videos and guys, uh, the t-shirts are super awesome. Unfortunately, it's only size L uh, for males, but I guess females can wear it too. And if you are, um, yeah, if it doesn't fit you, maybe you have a good friend or you can put it into your frame and put it on your wall, whatever. In any way, um, let's go to the operation now. And we are doing Operation Mambo as we at the moment always do because it's the least uh, hassle for all of us. and. It's just smooth sailing and I think I will do tonnage um, and I've boosted three statues and um, tonnage is pretty straightforward. I will flare to the to the rocket launches here and once I'm there I will shock them and uh, take them out and then I will harvest gunboat energy and when I've done that uh, meanwhile I will actually boom those three rocket launches up there and then I will move in 
uh, most likely I will uh, flare around the corner uh, starting from the sniper torso or from this power cell on uh, flare around the corner with smokes and protect myself against the, the flamethrowers and the mortars and I'm a bit worried about the flamethrowers but I should be fine I will most likely need to to shock here I'm a bit worried about the mortars so we will most likely need a shock for the mortars and a shock for the flamethrowers while I'm relocating up there um, I don't see another way um, it is uh, too much of a gunboat energy waste to throw away um, uh, gunboat energy on the mortars I guess uh, it will be a bit bit difficult not difficult but it will be a bit dangerous I reckon um, getting into the corner but it should be alright let's attack and there we go and it's quite a while since my last uh, uh, task force operations video and I think I will do more of them now because they're apparently quite popular and so I don't see a reason why I shouldn't hold, uh, should hold back on them. So um, yeah, I will definitely bring much more of those videos. And I don't want my troops to spread out on the left side, but it doesn't really matter that much. And I think it is now time to actually flare in front of the rocket launchers and uh, take them out right away. And guys, do it quick and do it safe because I don't want to spend a, wet, a med kit or to lose any more uh, gunboat energy. Let's flare up into that corner and actually go ahead and take out the rocket launchers here. And I think it will go with two barrages. Um, just or I, I think it will go with three barrages and then it will go with artillery shells. And we will see how that goes. And do you see those random rockets of the barrages? One, two. I think it will be three artillery shells. Whoa, this is really a long time to travel over the map. It takes forever for the rockets to arrive. And actually, I didn't toss that last artillery shell because I actually uh, tapped on the corner, which is not part of the playing field and one is still standing, which is quite unfortunate But okay, and let's see what my troops are doing there They are harvesting a lot of gunboat energy and I have to keep an eye on the time um, so I think I will actually um, Move over there now to the top right so that I will come in from the top when I circle around the corner and um, I have so much gunboat energy. I'm considering uh, taking out uh, the mortars. Um, I think that might be a good idea. I don't know, but I think it will be so much gunboat energy that it's not worth it. I will better go with shocks there and even uh, maybe some critters and guys move a little bit faster now. Um, this would be advisable. I will flare one more time over here to speed it up now because I'm already down to 1 minute and 52 and I will toss one artillery shell actually on those two boom mines there um, just because I can and now I think I will prepare to flare over there. I think I'm ready to go now. There we go. And let's toss some smokes immediately and I have to bear in mind um, that the smokes are traveling actually quite some time until they get there and so I will need to make sure that I toss the smokes early on um, because otherwise I will get screwed and yeah relocate into the top corner there guys relocate over there and now I actually need to go with the uh, shocks there we go I think that was good timing um, everything is shocked I should be in good position now I mean the the what the, uh, the boom cannons are actually shooting but I really don't mind the boom cannons and yes this is all looking very good guys all looking very good now I just need to get rid of the mortars on the on the right side and then I should be good and this is all looking very smooth very very smooth I will go with another critter box there and uh, tonnage is going down uh, this was pretty easy actually I mean I was boosted but I think I might even do it without the boost uh, the only tricky part was the smoking and the shocking because in the moment where the shock launchers turn on you they might uh, you know flame all your sukers in one go and the mortars might pick up like all sukers with one shot and then that's it and you're screwed and that was tonnage and yeah I didn't lose that many troops which is actually very nice 
And yeah, guys, um, let's have a quick look at the leaderboard. We're doing not too bad at the moment. We are close to hitting top 50. We are actually rank 56 right now. So we will hit top 50 very, very, very soon. So stay tuned for that. And yep, um, back to the giveaway. Um, yeah, just share my videos on Twitter. I will um, put all the names into Excel, will assign numbers, will then generate a random value and uh, get the winners by that. And this is, I think, the fairest and most uh, you know effective way to do it and guys if you see any risks or any reasons why this should not work please post it in the comments let me know because i want to give the t-shirts to you and i need your feedback and i want it to be the most fair and most transparent way and i'm also uh, i thought about it and i'm also going with about two and a half weeks or two weeks because some of you might work some of you might be on vacation and i want to give everyone the chance to actually participate and yeah guys um i hope you enjoyed that quick video and i hope you have a good day and stay tuned for more and see you soon guys Bye.